Hello everyone, Dylan from Gamers Lair here, and today I'm going to be opening up a Bunko Collection booster box in English. Uh, Fujimi Fantasia Bunko. So I had one of these stashed away, because I really wanted to open one. They were definitely pretty hard to come by, and this is the only one I've got, but I am pretty excited to tear into this thing. Got our box topper, the Amiibo <laughs> Triumphant. So that's cool. It's from Amiga Park, which I have not seen, but it's a good show from what I hear. We got a bad tear on that one. Ugh. All right, first pack. <laughs> So the cool thing about this one is, oh, <laughs> wow, all right, well, that's uh, not what I was going to say, but all right, that's 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 a really nice pull. Um, no, I was going to say the cool thing about this set is that it's got so many different animes in it, but, uh, man, that is nice. I, I definitely didn't expect to get the signed card. <laughs> and it's one for a series I really like. This is Teen from Akashic Records. Really nice. And uh, <laughs> first pack, nonetheless. Very happy to open that there. Well, I think we've kind of hit the high point, but... <laughs> uh, so we got Unique Mage Corpse, and for our climax, we got Welcome to Amiga Park. Don't actually think I've opened Weiss on this channel before, but... 2020, why not start now? So we got the many different festivals as our rare. This is our climax. I hope I got a good shot on that. I think of the uh, <laughs> the sign carry that was that was pretty nice. Absolute God. And we got the secrets inherited from mother to child. 20 packs and we only got one box, so may as well enjoy it while we can. Go nice and slow on these guys. Okay, got sibling affection. Solid situation panic. Ooh, so we got Ultimate S, Akino, and Irreplaceable Daily Life as our Climax card. Let's see if I can adjust the camera a little bit. There we go. That should be a bit better. <laughs> Maybe a little late after I've opened that sign here, but uh, that's so nice. Could not be happier with that. Oh, eh, I guess you still get your foil. I thought you didn't get your foil, but they always uh, surprise me. So, we got Teresa, which is a really nice SR. And it is actually textured, which is pretty cool. I didn't actually know they did that for SRs, at least not recently. We got our Climax card. So, definitely a pretty nice box, even if I didn't get the box topper that I wanted. Can't complain. So many cool characters in this set. We got Sistine. All right, Kurumi. Nice. One who fulfills ambitions is our climax. Another Sistine. A hey, Frail Exorcist. Journey to the Afterlife. Mm. 
Master of Swordsmanship. We had a Full Metal Panic one, nice. Uh, what's really useful for this set if you're not 100 percent sure and you, for example, really recognize the anime, you can actually just say, "Hey, that's Student Council Discretion." Uh, it's right there at the bottom. Let's you know what anime they're from, and they all do that. So regardless of which anime it is, since this is a mixed anime set, it's really handy to have that at the bottom. It's a really nice touch. I know it's for copyright reasons, but at the same time, I still appreciate it. Ooh. Adnasia. Another welcome to Mika Park. So we got, what do we got? Eight packs left? I think so. Check out. So we got another Teresa. Eden of Everlasting Summer. Really nice art on this card. I also really like how there's not many screenshots in this. A lot of them are unique art, which I'm pretty happy about. Because it makes for a really nice binder. Ooh, Chaika. Didn't even know that was in here. Kaneko. Oh, that's an uncommon. I thought she was a rare for some reason. Like economy. It's a rare. And Attack of Steel. There's our climax. So we got Chizuru and Story of the Princess. Ooh, under one roof. Another love story of the princess. So there's a lot of uh, <laughs> Akashic Records, and I really like that anime, so it's very nice for me. But I've seen pretty much all of these as far as I'm aware. Uh, obviously, I like some of them better than others, but I'm pretty sure I've liked all of these animes. So this is a really big treat for me to be able to open this set. Because when the set released, I was not able to get any for myself. They were all spoken for, and it's a very short print run, so this is certainly a big treat. So we got Healthy Outdoorsy Girl and First Friend as our climax. Nobana and another first friend. Two packs left. Ooh, this occur me. It's a nice double R. We got battle at the beginning, or <laughs> beginning of the battle. And we're on the last pack. Student Council President, and we got another solid situation panic. So I'm just going to quickly pause and we'll go through a quick recap of what we got. Alright, so quick recap. Here are the rares that we have. Now we move on to double R's. Our one SR, which is very nicely textured, although it's kind of hard to see in the sleeve. And of course, I wish I 
had prepared for pulling a sign curve. I do actually have a mini snap, even if it has a little bit of a crack there. But a very beautiful inherited magic talent sustain. Absolutely incredible. Very happy with that. So all in all, pretty darn amazing box. Really couldn't have asked for better um, other than the box topper. But hey, uh, I'll take what I can get. I'm not a complainer. So thank you all very much for watching. Um, if you enjoyed this, please let me know. I'm definitely up for doing more of this kind of a video uh, for games that I don't uh, open up very often. Uh, but I'm definitely going to still keep going with the regular stuff like Flesh and Blood, uh, Force of Will, uh, Yu-Gi-Oh, all that kind of stuff. So make sure you're subscribed if you want to keep viewing this content. Uh, let me know what you think, what you did and didn't like. Uh, and once again, thank you very much for watching.